Hey guys, thanks for clicking on this video. My name's Danny. I'm on my journey to becoming a doctor, but in this video, explaining to you guys why medical admissions is changing forever. They will not participate in the 19th When we see inequalities City, in society, we can choose two paths. These terrible evils and injustice. To ignore it, or like Martin Luther King, we can do something about it and make a change. Social inequalities voice, don't just have to be declared. about race. Human rights they exist in medicine rights, too. Topical examples are, are the lack of access women, to the COVID-19 the underrepresentation of women in medical research, they and even right from the beginning, there is inequality, inequality in whom we train to be the doctors of tomorrow. Just like the rest of the world, this needs to change. The majority of us would agree that the better prepared a student is, the better they'll do in an exam. So therefore, the kids that go to the best schools receive the best preparations and therefore have the best chance of getting into medical school. Therefore, those that go to the private schools or the top grammar schools are going to do better than those that ha only have access to, let's say, comprehensive secondary school. Medical schools select students that do well in exams because it's a really intensive course. So therefore, there's lots of exams on the course things like anatomy, pathology, etc. So you need to be able to do well in those exams to be a proficient professional. There is also a lot more applicants than there are places. So they can be very picky about what they want from their students. So they tend to just use a traditional approach where they just rank people on what their scores were on their exams. And that's who they invite to the interview stages. But we're forgetting about the people that don't have the access to that education. So we need to try something different. I will try and explain contextualization to you, a concept used by Kenton Medway Medical School to try and combat the inequality. Student one goes to a school with an average score of 50 and scores 70. Student two goes to a school with an average score, school score of 80 and score 75, which is both over the 70 threshold to get into the medical school. So which student should get a place? In an ideal world, I would hope that we could give the place to both students, but that's just not, just not the case in reality. Uh, hopefully you would pick student number one. You know, this student has risen above and achieved higher outcomes than would be expected given their surroundings and their situation. In medicine, we need individuals that overcome challenges and as doctors, they're gonna be dealing with adversity every single day. Widening access to medicine is something that every medical school takes really seriously and puts a lot of their budget into. As a new medical school, Kenton Medway Medical School will have the opportunity to break boundaries and hopefully form an approach that will change medical admissions forever. It's good to have a range of medical schools that are selecting for slightly different things so that we're not just given uh, students four offers. Now there's nothing wrong with a student getting four offers but what that means is that we're all selecting for the same thing and if we select for slightly different things then it means that there'll be a wider range of students that will be able to take part in medicine and hopefully there won't be any need for these clearing services in medicine. Now if you're watching this video you may be someone that this will affect in the future and I hope that it helps you when you come to your application. Thanks for watching this video. If it helped you or you found it interesting at all, then click the subscribe button because I'll be making more content like this one. I will be starting medicine at Kent and Medway Medical School in September. So if you want to follow my journey, head over to my socials. They'll be in the comments section. Um, and peace out to all of you.